Hai, I'm Alex from Lift Up and Travel. Welcome to Seratan Grand Jakarta. Selamat datang di Seratan Grand Jakarta. Let's have a look This is the Sheraton Grand, which is part of the Marriott Group in Jakarta, Indonesia. And little did I know this would be such a personable and heartwarming stay. The full details for the room and the price paid can all be found in the description below. Now it's off to the 16th floor to check out the room. If you're having fun, please be sure to help by subscribing and liking below. And once we hit 1000 subscribers, one lucky person will receive an amenity kit from our travels. I love the different spaces in the room. You've just seen the safe and the open cupboards, and on the opposite side is a wonderful bathroom. I have to compliment the designer for the use of these lamps which create warmth in a room full of white stone etched with black hints. It also comes with complimentary water, two drinking glasses, flannels and body lotion. Soap as standard and a mystery box which contains all types of goodies. The glass is frosted so no concerns about being seen. And on the end of the bathroom is the toilet, shower and a lovely big bathtub. So this room's interesting because normally in a suite you have different rooms, but in this one it's sort of like a huge space with lots of different areas. Quite like it. There is a cosy office on the right, which is opposite a lovely ottoman and I have to say a very comfortable king size bed. And again, like all the hotels in Jakarta, they're really tall. And that really creates like a nice light space. Beyond the 40 inch TV is a pretty white cabinet which houses the coffee, various cups, and a mini fridge. Next to the side window is a plush sofa and chair. Ooh, and what's this? I hold Marriott Platinum status and I absolutely love the welcome drink, nuts, and the posh chocolates. I don't know whether it's like just chains in general, but in Jakarta in particular, every hotel there as well, there's been some kind of little treat or gift or something. And I know it obviously costs the hotel money to do, but it, it makes such a difference. It makes you feel like you're getting a proper tailored personal service. And the last thing to do is just show you the view, which is a little bit difficult because the sofa's blocking this one. So that's the room. Let's go have a look at the pool and the gym. The gym is really well stocked and open 24 hours a day, which is great if your body clock doesn't know what country you're in. If you're wondering why the hotel looks deserted, that's because I've come during the week of Ramadan, which is typically when Muslims go to visit their families, meaning the streets are much quieter. I could sit here all day, but I've not eaten in a while. Luckily, the lounge on the 20th floor provides complimentary food to certain room types and to platinum or above members. Let's roll. Online, people often say that the food in the lounge isn't meant to be a full meal, but with this much incredible choice, there is no reason to go out. We are, however, staying at the Western London in April, one of our favourite hotels, but the lounge food in the evening was poor. Be sure to check it out over the coming weeks on our channel. Back to Jakarta, where I'm enjoying dessert and a signature drink. Time for a catch up with Brent. See you in the morning for more food at breakfast. It's one of my favourite times, and that's breakfast time. The breakfast didn't disappoint, and let me tell you at the same time why there's such an amazing stay. You always expect the employees to give great customer service and be attentive. But the difference here is that they genuinely love working here and engaging with customers. They also explained how supportive the hotel manager was during COVID. Travelling solo can at times be a lonely one, so a huge thank you to Milani and to Theresia for the laughs and the long conversations. They're also aspiring Instagrammers, so please check out their accounts, which can be found in the description below. So unfortunately, that's my stay at the Sheraton Grand over. What did I think about the hotel? Well, regardless of whether the hotel is good or not, and it is such a good hotel, what I found amazing was how personable and how nice the staff were. They were so interested to talk to the customers, to take an interest, and even when I saw like a family with two kids, they were happy to sort of entertain the kids, to look after them, and that's something you can't buy with money, and I can't wait to come back. Until next time, subscribe and like below if you enjoyed the video. Where are we? The Sheraton, Sheraton Grand, Grand Jakarta. Jakarta. Eh, it's, and then... it's, it's, it's recorded. <clears throat> Hi, I'm Alex from Lift Up and Travel. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs>